Good day kids. Here we are again with another episode of our information and communication technology 6 learnings today. We will discuss about different types of web applications. At the end of the lesson, you are expected to enumerate different types of web applications. I am your teacher, James Christian Urbeo, and I hope you would listen attentively with the discussion I have prepared for you. So, sit back, relax and enjoy learning. Wikis, blogs, and video conferencing are web applications that enable businessmen, students, educators, and individuals to communicate with one another throughout the world. These are different types of wiki websites associated with each other one. Wikipedia This is a free, open, and multilingual online encyclopedia where any user can collaborate, contribute, and edit the article to. Wiki Wiki Web This is the oldest, open, easiest, and fastest web-based collaborative tool in the world. Three, Wiktionary This is an online multilingual dictionary that contains the meaning, origin, and pronunciations of words for. Wiki Quote This is a collection of references or quotations from well-known people, books, movies, etc. Five, Wikiversity This site supports free learning communication, projects, materials, and other learning resources that may be used in all levels, types, and styles of education. Six, Wiki Travel This is a travel guide that uses Wikimedia software. It provides information about the history, people, culture, and background of different countries. Seven, Wiki Species This is a directory of species of all forms of life ranging from animalia, plantae, fungi, bacteria, etc. 8. Wiki News This is a compilation of news stories made possible through collaborative journalism. 9. Wiki Books This is a free library of educational books and manuals that may be edited, changed, and improved by anyone. 10. Activity Time, Direction, Explore the different Wiki sites using the Internet. Write your observations inside the box. Remember, a wiki allows many individual users to create a website, to register a domain, to add, remove, and edit the content of a web page using any web browser, quickly. Thank you for watching, I hope you've learned a lot. Don't forget to subscribe, James, or Bayo, for more educational videos. Till the next upload, thank you.